Now we all know the saying that diet and exercise is the most important way to take care of your health, specifically diet. And it's something that many of us take for granted. Now, although this is important at any age, it's specifically important in your later years, especially if you're in an assisted or independent living community. Well, diet is the number one priority at the gardens at Brook Ridge in Far, Texas. And we have Chef Lopez here to tell us more about how you can count on them to take care of your health with a diet in mind. Thank you for joining me, Chef Lopez. Thank you for having me. So let's start off with the most important question. How important are the foods we eat for our brain health or our overall wellness? Well, the foods that you uh, eat are the fuel that gives your body the energy it needs to do the things you enjoy. With everything in life, there must be a balance with what you put on your plate. So I would say that is one of those important things in your whole lifespan. So basically from youth all the way to adult. I love that. I love that mentality. And I think it's something that we need to sort of refocus on as a country is the importance of health and being conscious of what we put into our bodies. Now you all practice something called the mind diet. Can you tell us more about that and what you offer there at the gardens of Bridge? The Mediterranean and Dash are both diets that zero in on the foods that affect the brain health. Our team are not only ensures that our food is healthy, but also delicious. The dining program at the gardens at Brookridge features the top foods recommended on the mind diet, including greens, uh, leafy vegetables, berry, berries, nuts, olive oil, uh, whole grain, fish, beans, and poultry. We avoid and limit ingredients such as butter, margarine, cheese, red meat, and fried foods. Our dining program also offers residents several choices each day, including the selection of fresh and healthy mid-morning and afternoon snacks and refreshments. Awesome, okay, well, I wanna visit because my stomach, <laughs> like, all of this sounds delicious. Now there is a lot of science and proof behind um, the diet association with different diseases or ailments. And there has been medical research proving that there is a correlation between diet and lowering the risk of Alzheimer's. Is that true? Uh, yeah, the mind is the biggest part. And while in fact, it's the engine. Mm -hmm. On the other hand, if we feed our body junk, our body gets fatigued slower and not fast to react. According to the American Psychological Association, gut bacteria Producing, uh, produces an array of neurochemicals that the brain uses to regulate a physiological and mental processes, including mood. So it is believed that 95% of the body's supply of serotonin, a mood stabilizer, is produced by gut bacteria. So mm -hmm. in fact, your mind is exactly what you eat. So yep. your whole body is stimulated by your stomach. What are some of the most popular mind diet recipes at the Gardens of Our Fridge? Uh, actually, some of the most popular uh, mind diets are chicken fajitas, grilled salmon, lemon pepper, just to name a few. As far as some of our sides, kidney beans are a favorite, mm -hmm. sauteed spinach, uh, fruit parfait, and cream of wheat. We create our menus based on favorites, and a big part of my day is spent table touching, asking mm -hmm. uh, our residents what they thought of the meal, how can we improve every single meal, and make it a pleasant experience, but not only a pleasant experience, but a delicious experience. If you're interested in learning more about Brookridge Retirement or the gardens at Brookridge, visit sunshineretirementliving.com.